the Rain Collective is the name of the channel. Let's hop right into it. Events will define you and reveal who you truly are. I'm a firm believer in it. I'm going to try to make this video quick. When things go wrong, when things are just not going your way, you're questioning, why the hell me? Why the hell these things are happening? That's the greatest, sometimes the greatest gift is that. It is the greatest gift because it's going to show you how powerful you are. It's going to show you how far you're willing to go. It's going to show you what type of man you are, what type of person you are. Anytime, and I had a lot of them, when it just didn't go my way, the majority of events just did not go my way. That's when I had to level up the most. That's when I had to truly become powerful. That's when I truly had to become, go on a certain type of level to really, really get it done because there was no choice. Because the other side of it was to go into a victim mindset and become a victim. And that definitely wasn't going to be an option. So when my back was against the wall, numerous occasions, numerous situations where shit is just not going right. And I'm questioning why the hell me? That is when I received my biggest lessons. That is really when I received my biggest level up. So now when these things happen, I don't call them problems. I used to call it problems and issues. I got a bunch of problems going on. It's like, man, I got a lot of lessons. I got some things I must learn. I see it as a way to expose weaknesses in myself. It's a way for me to learn. It's a way for me to level up. It's my school. It's my teaching. All of these things. When I get the win and it does go my way, it's just confirmation. I don't rest on the win. I rest on the problem. When the problem arises, okay, how am I going to handle this? How am I going to deal with this? How am I going to figure this out? And this is something that I'm sure plenty of you out there are dealing with, have dealt with, are currently dealing with right now where I, have, I know it's rough. I get it. I've been through numerous situations where, okay, how? How am I going to get through this? And nobody's coming to save you. Let's start there. Nobody is coming to save you. The sooner you can realize that, the sooner you, you can turn into the person that you need to be to overcome this problem. And listen, the problem might not be dealt with overnight. It might not take a week. It might not take a month. It might be an ongoing thing, but you're going to become stronger that you can handle it. Your shoulders are, are going to become broader that you can handle the weight. You can handle the stress. You can handle it. You don't want the problems to go away. You're not asking for that. I'm not asking for that. I stopped asking for that. What I ask for is I can become a stronger person so I can handle it, so I can crush it, so I, can, I know how to deal with it. I know what I need to become that I can crush these problems and I can ex accept the weight and then I'm running with the weight. Give me more. Give me more lessons. That's your superpower. That's my superpower. The superpowers in those lessons because when things get rough and it, events just start happening unexpectedly, you're going to say to yourself, I've been here before. I've dealt with this before. I've handled this stress before versus somebody who they just wear their little loafers with no socks, never been through anything. And the minute something goes wrong, they're, they're ready to jump out the window. And you're like, wait a second. That's a good day. What you're stressing about, what you're ready to jump out the window for, that's light work to me. You can handle my problems. That's how you have to start attacking these things. Instead of becoming and transforming your mind into that victim mindset, which I'm very much guilty of. So I didn't know how to handle it. I didn't know how to deal with these problems. I, I was calling them problems. Why me? Like, why is this happening? Why? As opposed to like, okay, this is for me. Listen, this is what's going on right now. Okay, let me rewire my brain. Let me think a little bit different. Let me strategize. Let me figure it out. I don't have an A and B plan. Like, okay, I don't have a B and C plan. This has to work. I have to get this done. 
And then when you realize you overcome it, then it's like, okay, you feel more powerful and it's like, okay, I can handle more. That's when that confidence starts to kick in. That's when your self-belief kicks in because you know yourself more because you know what you're willing to do when it gets crazy, when it gets rough, you know how far you're willing to go. You know when it's in when you're in the trenches, when you're in the gully, when you're in the gutter. You know the type of person you are. You know you can elevate. You know you can rise up to the occasion. You're raising your hand like, okay, I can handle this. Pick me. Coach, pick me. Let me handle this. Let me take care of this. It's your superpower. So whatever you're going through, whatever you're going to go through soon, eventually, because there's always going to be a speed bump somewhere. It's going to happen to you. You just have to be mentally mentally prepared, physically prepared, emotionally prepared, spiritually prepared, but it's going to come. And that's just life. And that's just how it works. The severity of it. I don't know. Everyone's different. Everyone's cards are different, but the problems are going to come. Excuse me. The lessons are going to come. It's up to you. Do you want to see it as a problem? Do you want to see it as a lesson? Do you want to see it as a problem? Do you want to see it as a lesson? More videos on the way. Hit that subscribe button. Let's go.